When you think of electrical engineering, what do you picture? No. Closer, but no. Electrical engineering is the study and application of electricity, electromagnetic fields, associated materials and components, including electronic devices, and associated programs and algorithms, including intelligence and adaptability to address a wide variety of needs across private, government, and industry sectors. Most people immediately think of electric power plants. This is just one of the many pathways you can take in electrical engineering. Electric power includes designing generators and transformers, monitoring and control equipment, and algorithms related to grid security, stability, and safety. Renewable energy sources and electronic equipment to interface these sources to the grid. Energy storage needed since renewable energy sources are usually intermittent. Vehicle charging equipment, smart meters, and network for automated billing. Another popular pathway is internet and wireless communications. Examples of these include computers and embedded processors, switches, hubs, and modems, fiber optic system components. Electrical engineers also support transportation infrastructure and vehicles. They design sensors, controls, motors, processors, algorithms for engine control, pollution control, collision avoidance, autonomous driving, environmental controls, window and seat controls, and others. Many electrical engineers spend their careers in healthcare. Electronics are used to measure and diagnose almost all aspects of the human body. To mention a few, there are CAT scans, MRIs, DNA analysis, 3D printing of tissue, concussion assessment, and human performance. Many devices help certain conditions. Equipment like pacemakers and hearing aids, cochlear implants, and bionic eye replacements are just the beginning. Other areas in which electrical engineering plays a substantial role is in consumer electronics, appliances, security, home automation, pharmaceuticals, and other industrial processes, manufacturing, agriculture, environmental monitoring, safety and security, law enforcement, and military. A few futuristic applications include micro-robotics, including implantable robots, controls, electronics, and algorithms for swarming robots and drones, quantum computer sources and sensors, and electromagnetic rail launchers for satellites. The next generation of electrical engineers will continue the progression of making the world safer, healthier, and more productive than ever before. Electrical engineering can be a very hands-on major in career. That is why UTA Undergraduate Labs has a variety of equipment and services to help students achieve their goals. The electrical engineering labs are located on the first floor of Niederman Hall. First of all, electrical engineers are not electricians. Electrical engineers, or EE students, build a variety of circuits in the labs such as amplifiers, voltage multipliers, transmitters, elevator control circuitry, pressure sensors, and motor controllers, just to name a few. In the lab is where you'll learn to master test equipment such as power supplies, signal generators, oscilloscopes, spectrum analyzers, and network analyzers. The EE undergraduate labs also has computers with Xeon processors loaded with software, including the Adobe Suite, ANSYS, NI Multisim, AutoCAD, Fusion 360, Eagle, LabVIEW, MATLAB, Keysight ADS, and much, much more. You can also learn to program and use microcontroller devices like Arduinos, Raspberry Pis, and also industry-leading microcontrollers like Texas Instruments MSP430 and MSP432, and microchips PIC controllers found in many consumer electronics. In your sophomore, junior, and senior design classes, 
you'll design and build many projects using the EE Makerspace. We have 3D printers just for EE majors. We even have printers made by EE students. Our mills allow you to create custom PCBs and antennas. It can also engrave and mill a variety of metals and plastics. The UTA EE Lab also stocks thousands of commonly used components used for labs and student projects. Throughout the semester, the EE Lab offers many different workshops to benefit students. Some of the workshops we offer include test equipment, programming Adafruit's NeoPixel addressable light emitting diodes or LED rings and strips, setting up and programming Raspberry Pis for custom touch screen buttons, sending and receiving data from your smartphone and controlling devices from your smartphone using Bluetooth, and controlling motors and servos, just to name a few of the workshops. Most of the EE workshops can be found on our GitHub page. Feel free to browse the repositories. The Electrical Engineering Labs also has a YouTube channel where we have instructional videos on Fusion 360, electrical engineering research videos, how to design 3D models and print them on the lab's or library's 3D printers, how to design printed circuit boards, how to install various connectors, and lastly, we showcase our students' projects. For more information, please search Google for UTAEE Labs to find our website. You can find user manuals for the EE lab equipment, a list of available equipment and resources, a list of makerspace equipment, videos on PCB design, and videos on how to solder properly. If you're interested in electrical engineering or have any questions, you can schedule a tour of the electrical engineering labs right from our lab homepage. Electrical engineering majors and electrical engineering intended students can sign up for the workshops from this site as well.